As we move from 4G communications to 5G and then eventually to 6G, the huge data rates that need to be delivered to mobile devices require a major densification of the, of the network infrastructure. There's two ways you can do that. You can either lay lots of new optical fibre, which is prohibitively expensive and involves digging up roads, or you can come up with innovative new solutions. And in free space, the Disruptive Technology Innovation Fund project that we have um, had funded, we've come up with uh, an innovative approach, um, which essentially involves creating optical antenna, which allow you to get the speeds of fibre optic communications but without the problems of laying new optical fibre and digging up roads. This can also be advantageous in developing countries where there might not be the infrastructure or it might not be ec economically viable uh, to, to lay optical fibre, but a free space optical communication uh, link would be economically viable. The consortium uh, tackling this problem are um, Pilot Photonics, uh, our company, Embryonics, uh, another innovative Irish uh, startup from Galway, along with our partners in Dublin City University and Trinity College Dublin. So, uh, Pilot Photonics and uh, Embryonics are bringing innovative technologies and then we're supported by world-class expertise and infrastructure and facilities in uh, Dublin City University and, and Trinity College. The potential of free space optical communications has been recognised by some of the biggest companies in the world. Um, Google, Facebook, Nokia have all um, carried out work in this area. We believe that the combination of our disruptive technologies really solves this problem in the best possible way, delivering enhanced connectivity for future generations.